This is the Tata Curve. Now, in case you think you've seen the curve before, well, you would be right and wrong in a way because this model that we see here is closer to production, unlike the earlier curve concept. And the earlier curve was an EV. This is powered by an internal combustion engine. Uh, yes, that's right under the hood here is a 1.2 liter turbocharged direct injection petrol motor. And that's the one that's also going to launch. So uh, Tata have the curve here. And uh, as you can see, it's still very, very concept like in that sense. But there are elements that are uh, more production friendly. So the earlier one had these uh, cameras. This one has a rear view, conventional rear view mirror. The rest of the curve, of course, large chunky tires. You've got the swooping curvy uh, roof line here, uh, which we saw on the earlier concept. Um, the flush door handles uh, and then you have this little recess which is which creates sort of an air curtain looks really nice and uh, Tata tell us is functional too for aero and aero work uh, at the back here is where you really see uh, the um, uh, coupe uh, effect uh, on, on the curve it's got this split kind of spoiler up top very large and uh, sort of long uh, swooping uh, tailgate the rear Again, similar to what we saw earlier, sharp LED lights that go all across the Tata logo in here and the curve lettering down below. So really, this is the Tata Motors uh, curve. As I said, we will see an electric version as well as a petrol and the car we see here, this is the petrol version. Tata haven't disclosed the power and torque figures as yet. All we know for now is it's a 1.2 turbo direct injection petrol.